Hey everybody, welcome. Welcome to this video. In this video, we are going to talk about the best web editors out there or the HTML editors, you can say, you can call whatever you want. So the idea is that uh, we have uh, plenty of the editors that we can install, which are like really cool, really best. The first one that I'm going to recommend is Sublime Text, excellent editor. Then we have Brackets. Uh, the third one is Notepad++ and the last one uh, that is like really cool. I really like it and that is the one that I'm going to install on Ubuntu that is named as Atom. Okay. So uh, control alt T. So first of all uh, before installing Atom you need to add a repository. So this is the command uh, sudo add apt repository then ppa then colons then web up update team and then slash atom okay so you write it and then you hit enter it asks you for the password you enter your password and then it would start to add the uh, repository so it asks you to to hit enter to continue or if you want to cancel it then you can press ctrl c so i think i have added it that's why it is like giving error again because if you have added it once then you do not need to add it twice right so use that command add it inside your computer into your computer and once you have done it then you need to run this command okay so you need to update your repositories so I have already added that that that's why it was giving me some sort of error the first time you will run that it will not give you any sort of error okay so once you have done it now you are going to uh, install atom okay so you hit enter and it starts to install you write here why yes I want to install so you start to install it it will take some time and once it is installed you can open it up and then you can open all sorts of web, web files maybe node.js files maybe uh, you want to open html files maybe you want to open css or php files whatever files related to the web web development sort of thing uh, you want to open in the atom editor you you can open that okay so now we will wait it will take some time to download okay so now after we have downloaded it and it is installed uh, what we can do that we can uh, go here and here we can search for atom and you can see that we have atom here so if you want to like pin it right here you can do that and if you now go back you can see that atom is right here so if you click it the editor uh, you know would open up so you can see that you have an option of opening a project you have a version control option with git and github you can collaborate in real time with teletype you can install a package you can choose a theme you can customize the styling and much more By adding some sample file here from you can new file you can create a new file you can open a new file so let's try opening a new file let's go here let's go to the vr folder ww folder then html folder then you know just try we try to like you know let's say that we open this php file right here so you know it has opened up all the uh, folders from the wordpress okay so it has taken it as a project and from here you can like open up any of the file that you want to open up okay so you can also if you cross this welcome screen okay so now you can see that this is like you know it is a very beautiful editor uh, it has given colors to uh, different uh, you know different functionalities different words and different functions okay so you can identify your code in a better 
way so you can change themes you can uh, install other packages you can uh, do a lot of stuff here you know just come here check it out i know this is one of the best you know web editors out there so if you if you are comfortable with any other editor such as node plus plus or sublime text editor or brackets you can go and you can use that as well but i think this adam uh, editor is best for web development purposes so i hope you have enjoyed today's video you have learned something new and i will see you in the next video